And then as an yet another project fitting of the high speed head. This head is the normal one, goes up to 1600 RPMs and has an ISO 40 taper, but there is no quill. Uh, if you want to then use it as a to bore out or on smaller end mills, for instance, you can use this up to 6000. And then it also has a quill. And this it also retracts. So this is quite a, a nice assembly. So now I wanted to address how to replace the head standard ISO 40 taper head with the high speed head with the quill. I made myself a, a fixture so I will drop that onto there to be able to show you the internal and what, uh, what I need to do in there. First, how to get this head off. According to the manual we have to position it like this and just Use a piece of rod, aluminium that is, insert here, and I raise the table. First of all, of course, and I raise the table. First of all, of course, I have already untightened, I loosened the four bolts holding the Head together. I can remove them all together like that. And now I crank the table up until it rests on the wooden blocks and it loosens by itself. Some persuasion, and then it's off. And then you can take the head off like that, put it aside, and now I want to go down with this all the way, and as you can see. This has a gear type of coupling for the standard head. I'll bring you closer and show you how it looks like for the this one. There is a square key that should go in here. And now what you do is that you you run the quill all the way down on the head here. You see like that. You lock it down like that. And now you drop this one onto the fixture. Fixture. And of course, you now position the heads and move them together. The four bolts here of course locates uh, actually just three of them into here but there's a snag here. As you can see this has a dog 
Scotch type of gear which is not the same as should fit into this one. The gear here is for the other head while this drive dog so to speak or drive key in here should have a, a corresponding piece of metal inside here. So I have to make up an adapter to fit onto here and on the other side onto here. And then I also have to make a, a plate that I think mounts on here about one centimeter, so a spacer plate, so to speak. And all this is because this head comes from a 53 and this is a 52. And on the 51 and 52 they used these kind of, um, of uh, uh, engagements, but switched to this type on the 53 and I believe on the 53N also. So that will be my project, at least coming project.